Hi boys and girls. Today is Monday, February 22nd, and we are going to be doing spelling together. For your spelling today, you need this page. And I'm going to go over, although I know you know how to do these, we're going to talk about this page and this page. Okay? So for now, we just need this page. We are, for our words this week and for phonics and when we're reading, we are talking about long E that has just an E, like a short word that has just an E on the end that makes an E sound, a long E sound. Words that have E, E in them that makes a long E sound. And E, A, when that's together, a, not all the time, but lots of times, that also makes a long E sound. Okay, so we are going to write out our words on this page, okay? All right. Number one, number one is M E. So that is like I was talking about here, short words that have an E on the end. This E makes the long E sound. It will say its name. And I know you know this word, but I just wanted to tell you how that works. Me, me. The E makes an E sound. The next word is like this one, K-E-E-P. Two E's together, like I said, two E's together makes that E sound. Keep, keep. I'm going to keep my coat zipped up because it's so cold, keep. When we write out our spelling words, they are always lowercase letters. We're not doing names, and we're not, these aren't sentences, so they need to be lowercase letters. The next word is like with E-A, B-E-A-K. B-E-A-K. E-A. Lots of times makes that long E sound also. Beak, beak. Like we talked about last week um, with the animals, the chicken had a beak in the story we read Friday. Um, oh no, not it wasn't in the story, it was in the practice book page. How it compared a duck and a chicken and it talked about the chicken's beak. That's what this is, beak, E-A. So, E makes an E sound, E, E makes an E sound, E, A makes an E sound. So this is going to take some studying this week to remember. Okay, number four is a review word. P, L, A. Play, A-Y, makes an A sound like day. We talk about what day it is. Always has A, A-Y. All right, number five, O-T-H-E-R. This is kind of a tricky one to remember how to spell other. I think this part's easy. Ther. When something ends in er, it's almost always going to be er. Okay? It starts with an o. That's the tricky part. Other. Just remember it starts with an o. Other starts with an o. Okay. Remember to pause if I'm going too fast. Number six is like number one, where it has just one E at the end. W E. Lowercase letters. 
me, we. Me, we. Number seven. F E E D. Two E's, like this word, like keep. Two E's make an E sound. Feed, feed. I will feed my cat. Feed. Number eight is like this one. S, make sure you're doing lowercase letters. E, A, T. I, I see a word in this one. Eat, seat, eat, seat. E, A makes that E sound. Number nine, R, A, I, N, a review word from last week. Remember, AI makes an A sound, rain, rain. Number 10 is going to be the hard one, but it's a word that you write, you want to write all the time and you probably ask how to spell it. Now you can learn it and know how to spell it. B E C A U S E. Oh, do you know what this word is? It has this, it has, oh, I'm standing right in front, you can't see. It has this in front, B, because, B, E, C, A, U, S, E, B, E, C, A, U, S, E, because. Our words this week, me, keep, Beak, play, other, we, feed, seat, rain, because. Those are our words this week. So as you are studying, they, you can color a coin. Did you look at this? We have these coins here, penny, nickel, dime, quarter. Penny, nickel, dime, quarter. Those are the coins that are on your page this week. Okay, so this side, or you could study and have someone put their initials every time you study. All right, your papers. Remember, you're only going to do one because you need to be practicing your words every day, okay? One today. So today, you can do four times each. You know how to do that. I don't need to explain it. Or doing ABC order. Remember, circle or highlight the first letter. Go up here and circle the first letter circle the first letter, go up here, circle the first letter. There are, I see two words that start the same. So you would put like a two underneath and then you have to look at the second letter of that word, those words, look at the third letter to figure out um, what order it's going to go in cross off the words as you use them. So you shouldn't have a word that starts with S and then all of a sudden have a word that starts with F after it. That doesn't make sense, so make sure you're really paying attention. Okay, this side. We haven't done papers like this as much. So if you choose, whatever day you choose to do this one, you have to do both sides. Okay, so you, you only have eight words on here. Um, it doesn't have play or rain, as all the other words on this side. 
you're going to write the spelling words that have two letters here and here. So you're looking to see which one has two letters. You're writing them there. For three, four, five, and six, write the spelling words that have four letters in them. So you need to look up here which words have four letters in them and you're going to write them on three, four, five, and six. And number seven, write the spelling word that has five letters in it. I'm going to write that here. And write the spelling word that has seven letters. You're going to write it here. Okay, the words with two letters here. And it says here, it has the numbers here. Two, four, five, seven. Okay, all right, so you're either going to do this today or writing your four times each and then tomorrow you're going to do the other one. Please don't do them both on the same day. All right, let's read the words. We're going to spell them and read them, okay? M E M E K E E P K E P B E A K B E K P L A Y P L A Y O T H E R O T H E R O T H E R O T H E R O T H E R O T H E R O T H E R A I N rain. Ooh, here's the hard one. B E C A U S E because. If this could be a, a good thing to help you remember how to spell because. A, so with this A U, because this is where people get mixed up as to what comes first, A or U. Remember, A comes first in the alphabet, so it comes first between these two. U is way down there, so A, then U. A, I know you can't see my chart, my chart way up here. A is way down there, and that's how because A starts first, then U. Maybe that'll help you remember what order A and U are in. Okay, so remember one spelling today and one spelling tomorrow. Don't do both because you just need to be practicing every day. Okay, so I will see you guys later. Make sure you do some reading today. Every day you need to read. You should have your reading books at home. Do some reading. Okay, bye.